Well, bad news today. I guess, thank God, it only affected parts of the property that don't, that didn't really have many valuables. But as you can see, some arsonist uh, targeted hoarder mans. Uh, all that's burned now. Uh, to be fair, these were rotting doors. Windows. I suspect this crater might be where it had originated. Uh, Waterman suspects maybe over here where all the tires are just completely melted. Uh, let me just get some autistic camera views. I mean, yeah, it was so hot that like the sinks here exploded. I mean, look, I'm no, I'm no fool. I know the sinks couldn't be used for much, but. Yeah, uh, all this is burned. Uh, the fire went all the way through here. Uh, for privacy reasons, I can't show you the trees that it ended on. Uh, it almost burned down his boat. And nearly burned down the mini camper. Uh, as you can see, it got to here. Then it got over there by the road. Uh, all this black stuff is just where the fire was. Uh, the weird thing is, is that no fire marshals, no nothing called Hoarder Man. Uh, they didn't notice this yesterday, so it might have happened earlier today. Still smells pretty fresh, honestly. Oh. Man, fuck this life. People can be so needlessly cruel. But anyway, uh, today's mission is just to get a couple more things off of here. I'm just gonna go get the rake. Uh, my goal is to at least get those milk canisters off. Probably put them under here somewhere. Um, and yeah. So far, so good. Just gotta slap my gloves on. It's very cold up here. Very, very cold. <sighs> really don't get it sometimes, you know? But, wish me luck. Okay, so, I got these milk cartons off. I really like the blue patina on this one. Sadly, this one's not doing too good. This one's solid. What's to say? Clyde... Clyde LeClaire 289... Windsor. I'll put this fellow right back here. And I'll put this fellow... Come on now. Right over here. This one has something in it. I'm not sure what. Not quite sure what. Uh, here. Luckily, I no longer need the ladder, because with the porch down as much of it as it is, I can just show you guys. Uh, so as you can s well, you can't really see. But that's a pile of pots. Uh, you can't really see from beyond the darkness, because this is just an iPod camera. But... Yeah, we're nearly there. Uh, next time, I'm just going to try to gently get that plate of china down. And this is a busted Sony sound system thing. Ooh, what are those? Teacups? And yeah, just some other miscellaneous kitchen stuff. Uh, similar to last time, I loaded everything into the back of the truck. And I use this push broom to grab off the stuff. Uh, let me show you two big things I brought down that were right on top of that hole. Uh, 
Uh, they're, they're both ruined, so, you know, I don't really mind leaving them out here. But just two little lounge chairs. Uh, again, you can't really see too well because the sun's setting. But yeah, got it all down. Despite the horrible news I got today of just showing up and someone clearly having tried to burn his property down, I'm happy. I'm happy that I'm able to get this far in it, you know? I'm happy. I'm happy that I'm able to get this far in it, you know? Uh, I guess closing thoughts. I know that some people said, hey, don't talk about the arson and whatnot. It might have been troll. Don't give them any attention. Which I'm not, but there's, I, I doubt... I doubt it would be just a fish tank troll because it wouldn't make sense to have burned down Horderman's place. I know that a lot of people in the community have, have been making fun of him long, long, long before he became Horderman. Uh, he used to throw wild, wild parties. Uh, believe it or not, his house was annexed by a biker gang back in the day. Uh, and there's one story where I guess him and his buddies were setting up a bonfire and his neighbor walked out. And just heard a giant explosion and just saw some guy on fire rolling around. Huh. Besides, if it is a troll, then... I mean, shit, they'd... They'd make it known pretty quick. You know? They'd brag about it somewhere to someone. Like they always do. But I suspect it's just some local who was like, LOL, fuck this guy. Let's just burn this down for shits and giggles. Who knows? Who knows? Anyway, hopefully I'll see you guys tonight. Gonna be going live early, but also ending early because I got jury duty tomorrow. That's gonna be a bitch, but hey, at least I can stream two days in a row. Oh, heavens, one last thing. I actually found something pretty cool. Uh, so this is just an old scale, old fo food scale. Uh, that was probably the coolest thing I took down off the porch today. But it's likely one of Horderman's wife's uh, family heirlooms. Because her family used to have a kitchen down south. Or a restaurant down south. And yeah, that's why this truck bed currently is just full of pot of old pots and pans and whatnot. Just wanted to share that with you guys. Because I know that you guys like seeing all the cool shit that shows up. An 80s Pennsylvania plate, huh? Ooh, a 58 New Hampshire plate. Ooh, a 61 New Hampshire plate. Ooh. But yeah, there's just so much cool stuff. Now, I do know that in the future, Horderman wants all of this sold. It's just an issue of, you know, I don't have the room in my apartment. Still trying to empty it out completely. And I don't have the connections. I'm really kicking myself at how hard it is to find connections, you know? Uh, I do remember a fan hitting me up saying that he has ties to some Northeast uh, flea market group or some shit. Uh, but hey, any connections for like Northeast New England area? Just to help me unload a lot of this shit. Every little bit helps. Money in my pocket, bulk of it, of course, goes to Hoarder Man. Because, I mean, hey, it is his stuff at the end of the day. What's this? Nice. Rubbing alcohol compound, huh? I do actually know some bottle guys. They may be interested in this. Ah. Oh. But yeah, y'all have a blessed night, and wish me luck this week. Be careful out there, because seems that there's a curse going around. <laughs>